good evening my dear students welcome to the science classroom and today i am going to teach you about coal and petroleum okay which is our chapter number 5 before that we know that today it is september 5th which is teachers day okay today is september 5 which is teachers day so who is the teacher the answer you will tell that teacher is a person who is teaching us science social english maths and all so about that the person who is guiding you to live a wonderful life the person who is having some experience to lead you a wonderful life on this planet okay we can call it as uh, the that person as a teacher and also the persons who are teaching the subject is also teacher and if you observe your some teacher if you are becoming sad sometimes the teacher will be asking uh, he will he or she will be inquiring or she, he or she will be advising such things and guiding you so in every person success when they are struggling this teacher appears and uh, there will be the fellow or a good person called teacher and he or she will provide the hand for you to arise from the problem so for example the uh, in our near in near days the indian captain mahendra singh dhoni retired so he was a football player in his childhood and uh, his coach diverted his career to the cricket field and he became so successful if you love cricket you can understand how successful he is so when a turning point was needed this teacher given the hand and guided the correct way like that i am wishing the students who are hearing me also to get the correct persons to lead you a good life and a wonderful life and also a successful life which is going giving you glory and happiness and today our subject is coal and petroleum so we are going to study about coal today last day we just uh, taken a small introduction about this and how the coal physically look like okay it is a black rock like substance okay uh, for appearance it will look like a black rock like substance okay then what are the uses of it earlier it was used to cook food and you heard about steam engine uh, now it is uh, the the railway engines are um, running using diesel or electric engines but previously it was steam engine and for generating steam this coal was burned in steam engine okay so now also it is used in thermal power plant to generate electricity to generate electricity it is used in thermal power plant then used as fuel in some industry okay it is used as fuel in some industry then this is the use of waste um, i said the somewhat the physical look of the coal and also some use of the coal then i am going to tell you a how the coal formed okay so about 300 years about 300 years before so about 300 years before the earth was full of forest okay there are there are, there were more forest in earth okay and in the lower lower places the low lands where the forest was there 
due to the natural calamities like flood and all what happen when flood increases you, you know that when flood is coming the water will flow or the rivers will over um, will overflow so what happen then vegetation was under the soil or under the water on and all then finally the soil get deposited over it again and again so finally this vegetation which was on top when soil is deposited over it and more over it what happen the vegetation when uh, when under the ground okay and it be, it goes deeper and deeper in the ground and what happen due to when it is going deeper and deeper the pressure and temperature in the soil is more the pressure and temperature become high okay and due to this pressure and temperature fossil fuels or coal are formed okay and coal consists of uh, the uh, coal consists of carbon okay when when we consider coal it, it is carbon so the converting the slowly 300 years million of years means how much you just think and um, when it is formed very it is very slowly forming so uh, when it is forming very slowly um because uh, the um content of coal is carbon we are calling it as the uh, process of fo fo forming carbon we are calling it as carbonization so it is also called a fossil fuel okay the vegetation are buried under the earth and uh, we will call it as fossil fuel okay then when the coal is heated in air okay when it uh, it is heated in air what happens carbon dioxide is produced then coal is processed to get some product like uh, coke and uh, coal tar and also um, uh, and also coal gas okay coal uh, coke coal tar and coal gas okay so these are the things we are going to we, we just studied about the coal okay and uh, once again coal is coal look physically like a rock which is black in color and uh, the uses pre uh, earlier it was used to cook food and um, used in engines then uh, um, then also now it is used in thermal power plant and used in some industries as, as fuel okay is it clear then in the story we know it is formed before 300 um, 300 millions of years ago and due to uh, the high temperature and pressure it is buried under the soil and uh, due to high temperature and pressure the fossil fuels are formed okay and uh, the main um, coal is coal consists of carbon and the slow process of um, converting this natural vegetation into into coal is called as carbonization and um, it is also called as coal is also called as fossil fuel then it is processed the coal is processed to get what coal tar coke then and coal gas okay which is which can be used for different our different daily purposes okay good evening my dear students welcome to science classroom and in our last class we studied about coal and we are dealing with chapter 5 coal and petroleum so let us study about petroleum today last class we dealed about coal okay today we are dealing about petroleum
so petroleum first uh, i'm i'm going to tell few words about petrol petrol okay so in case of uh, if so if you observe your father's motorcycle or your uncle's motorcycle what the, what fuel is used to uh, operate that uh, vehicle or uh, some small cars which fuel is used to operate that one we will without doubt we will say that it is petrol for example some scooters the small lightweight uh, motorcycles uh, cars and also scooters we will use petrol to operate so next i am going to say something about diesel diesel okay diesel is used in which type of vehicle you see heavy mercedes benz um ashok leyland lorries etc big buses trucks etc tractors etc use petrol uh, sorry diesel as a fuel okay diesel as a fuel and from where this two come from from where this come uh, to come from it come from a natural resource called uh, petroleum okay a natural resource called uh, petroleum about that we are going to study today okay about that we are going to study today and this name petroleum okay from where the name petroleum came okay the name petroleum came from petro one word which means rock and oleum oleum which means oleum which means oil okay the word petroleum came from petro which means rock and oleum which means oil okay and this petroleum is mined between the rocks okay um under the earth the rocks under the earth is mined and this and this petroleum is mined from this rock inside the earth okay inside the surface of earth so i'll i will for understanding i'll draw a figure here and now uh, this is the surface of earth and uh, it, uh, under the soil and all there will be rock okay there will be rock and all and after that some other more other more type of rock substance also secondary type of rock sub substance were there after that there will be a one layer in that in some substance will be water okay water and some layer will be this um, petroleum okay petroleum and uh, in above layer there will be will be gas okay or oil deposition some oil deposition will be here okay so this is the this is the figure in this this is the sur surface of earth under that what is there there is the rock deposit okay the rock deposit if you are digging or mining up to here that means uh, you heard about mumbai uh, i like that uh, the wells we are mining when wells we are digging what will happen it will reach the mm, first layer of the a rock after that it reached the second layer after going it after passing this two layer there will be one layer where will be water uh, there will be one layer where the uh, substance will be gas oil and water okay gas oil and water and from here the gas and oil etc are mined through wells 
and this petroleum is mined okay understood then how petroleum formed over here in this area how the petroleum formed okay how the petroleum formed in this area like yesterday we studied about coal many years before okay many years is before it was formed under the sea okay it is the dead particle of the um, sea organisms which uh, which have died and the body got deposited on the surface of the sea and like coal the soil and clay in the sea get deposited over it and again uh, due to a um, continuous deposition again and uh, again it is deposited over it and what happen it goes compressed in the surface of sea okay it got uh, suppressed in the or the water surface uh, it is got it got com uh, compressed in the water surface no air is there but high pressure and high temperature is there okay and due to this uh, dead particles of organism is compressed inside the compressed under the water bodies or the earth and petroleum is formed after many years under high pressure and temperature the dead organisms are transformed to petroleum like yesterday um, in case of coal what happened the forest particle or the trees the plants etc compressed in high temperature and pressure and inside the soil here also in high temperature and pressure it got transformed to petroleum and also not only petroleum natural gas we here we studied there are three layer is there we i am just taking this one layer okay this one layer i am taking there will be one layer which is gas and another one layer which is oil and one more layer will be there which is water so and uh, we are going to study about wells okay for mining petroleum we are digging wells okay we are going uh, we are going to get a small account of that the first oil well okay the first oil well was digged in pennsylvania pennsylvania which is in usa the country usa in the year 1859 in the year 1859 and what about our our side india after 6 years a place called makam in assam um we digged the uh, we, we have found, found the oil deposit or dig the um, mining well for mining petroleum and in india this oil uh, oil or petroleum is found in Assam, Gujarat, and you heard about Mumbai High. It is very popular for petroleum. So, and uh, the basins, river basins of Godavari and River Krishna. It is famous for um, oil deposit or petroleum deposit in India. And you know why uh, Gulf countries is rich because they are having lot of mining wells. So. let let us go to the next 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 portion